Did I introduce the stream yet? Hey everyone, FPS Chazla here. Welcome back to Coldwater's 84 campaign. With the old uh, Victor Tree here. Uh, I think this intro is actually... Well, after the video will have started, but... <laughs> a little out of it today. Eastern Bloc Marines leading the invasion of Norway have made significant progress in advancing inland. Looks like something was captured back. Alright, where them tank is and tend is at. We're coming all the way from Newport. Could be a while. <clears throat> Hilti brand, hello. <laughs> Reported for inappropriate speech. The proper term is gonads or balls. Oh god, they're all coming towards me. <laughs> Took the 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 least bad of a bad situation, flanking it to the tender as opposed to getting headed off by one of those ravenous submarines. Strong duct. Woo! Moderate layer. Woo! 233 Sierra 1. It's the middle of the day. <clears throat> is this, is it gonna keep these settings? Might as well see. Okay, 233. Ah, we're gonna have to surface stuff. Go from afar because we were juicing. On rig ship for ultra quiet. Con, I think we've been detected. Horse shit. <laughs> Welcome aboard, everybody. Two, three, three. Con, sonar, new con. Turns four, five knots, maneuvering eye. What do we go? <sighs> con sonar, new contact bearing, two, three. Con maneuvering, making turns four, five knots. Con sonar, new contact bearing, two, three, four. Designated Sierra, three. That uh, Ob Oberon? Con sonar, Sierra, three, is classified as a submerged submarine. Con, sonar, and the Oberon just freaking launched at me. Yeehaw. Okay. Come right to oh, no, two, not that. Three, Do I, this. Helm, I. Make turns for one, five knots. Maneuvering eye. Shoot two, five. Aye, sir. Oh, uh, that stallion may have come in handy, four, but no, it's aye, sir. a bit too late for that. Con, maneuvering. Making turns for one, five. Make turns for Two zero knots, maneuvering eye. Con helm, steady course. Come left to one three one helm eye. Andoya is an island. Am I saying that right, Andoya? Con sonar, launch transient from Sierra oh, three. Keep it in your pants, Sierra three. Grab his dick and twist it. What? Con helm, steady course. Oh, thanks, Abajuk. <clears throat> oh, I'm actually pronouncing Andoya right. Well, well. Oila. They do not seem to be alerted to my presence yet. Interesting. I'll reload these tubes, please. And reload both tubes. Oh, is he good at Red October, my frickin' torps? I always frickin' set these things to enable too, too close, because I got no sense of frickin' scale. Okay, we're gonna have to give him another. Make turn four. Five 
five knots, maneuvering eye. Con, torpedo room, tube four ready. Con, sonar, lost contact. Sierra, two, last bearing, two, three, five, contact faded. Con, maneuvering, making turns for two, five knots. Ship class Ola. Con, torpedo room, tube three ready. Did he just launch these torps? <clears throat> just full flank it here. Did I launch a passive torp at him? I don't know. I may have. Oh my god, guy. <laughs> yeah, those stallions would have been handy. He's being quite annoying. Hell yes, hello. Oh yeah, since the last time, thanks to Nox underscore underscore for following. Yeah, it's just, I, I guess it just looks like a, a good distance for me to set it to enable, but it's like... It's always too close. <laughs> if he drops like a count, oh, see, look at that crap. Ugh. It's like if he drops a countermeasure, it'll lure it right in. <clears throat> oh, now this guy ain't going after anything. Might get an acquisition as he gets closer. Damn, this is so bronze being really annoying. Or I'm just really off of it today. <laughs> Con sonar, noisemaker, bearing two, five, five. Uh, for retractable blades, I think that's like a. Uh... Con fire control weapon countermeasure homing. Ooh, look at that. That's like a. Surface through the ice kind of thing. I feel like I've also heard they retract them at high speed. Is this dill hole gonna need another? I want to see where all these uh, inbounds are at real quick if we can't. Con sonar regained contact on. Make turns for five knots, maneuvering eye. Con sonar regained contact. Okay, they just launched some. I can't one. see those yet. All those are just kind of going wherever. Let's just keep going. Make turns. For I know that. Okay, there you go. Five knots. Thunk. Make turns for three zero knots, maneuvering eye. Okay, I think he's just going to keep shooting towards at me. He's being rather cheeky breaky. Do that, please. And uh, let's split the difference, too. Shoot, Using all my frickin' torps on the god dang Oberon there. Might need to get some stallion. Stallions on his ass there. <clears throat> Sort of like U.S. subs could point their dive planes up vertically to surface through the ice. Yeah, and then like... Con sonar, noisemaker, bearing, two, five, five. Probably retract them when you're in port. Con, torpedo room, tube three ready. Oh, there's a plane. There's a 
and flank it up, please. Make turns for three zero knots. Maneuvering eye. There's a pay three. Pay three. <laughs> what is that? <clears throat> Sonar lost contact. Sierra two. Last bearing two five one. Contact faded. Con torpedo room tube four ready. Forget to retract them. Donk. Ah, that won't buff out. Last second countermeasure. Con sonar, noisemaker, bearing two, five, seven. Go to port. Ah, they always go the wrong frickin' way. <laughs> well, these torps may inadvertently hit far contacts. Okay, those tiger fish are slow. I want to take another, take another look, see where they're at. I thought I launched more tiger fish in this vicinity. Con sonar hey, look at that. Incidental zero, oiler two, sinkage. <laughs> All right, well, I don't see anything. Make turns for one, five knots. Maneuvering eye. Con maneuvering. Making turns for one, five knots. Come right to one, six, five, helm, I. <clears throat> one twenty, sweet mother. Con sonar, noisemaker, bearing two. Those five, Oilers a target? Six. Hell yeah. Hey, this is a, like a submarine tender mission. Ooh, 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 ooh. Sounds good. No. Oh, no, we're not going to get another incidental oiler hit. All right, Mr. Guy, what are you doing? Are you hanging out? Are you maneuvering? Maneuver props engaged. Setting new course. Seems to ever so slowly be turning. Con, fire control, weapon countermeasure homing. What the hell was that, Mr. Torpedus? <clears throat> A G's. Zygra, hello. Oh, your noisemakers. That guy gotta get vacuumed up. Okay, this oiler's like, yeah, bye. But, gotta wait for, uh... Wait for him to steady out before shooting. Con sonar, noisemaker, bearing two, six, three. Nope, don't think it's gonna get vacuumed up there. The red tip that makes them extra, extra spicy. Ah, uh, no, there's only uh. 
two Oberons, but the solution keeps getting mucked up because he's maneuvering. The red ones are the big honker Wakehomers, 65 centimeter torpedoes. Got a range, an obscene range. 80 kilometers <laughs> active. <laughs> <clears throat> Really puts the heavy in heavyweight, but only for ships, only for surface ships. Con sonar, noisemaker, bearing two, six, eight. Oh my god, this guy is pissing me off. It might be stallion time here. Oh my god, so close. Just out of that cone, huh? Don't swing back the other way. Oh, no, that one's going over there. All right. Uh, 61 meters. <clears throat> Make depth six, one, die by. I grow weary. Is there a glitch? I got zero on the toad for the Obron. It looks like my toad is deployed. Zero on the oiler. Oh, is it just deaf at this speed? Okay, that could be. <clears throat> English voiceover on Russian sub. Yeah, I mean, Russian voices ain't gonna tell me what's going on. <laughs> it's really the only reason why, so I don't have to read everything they're saying. Because if I were Russian, it would sound like it does now. Okay, I think one of those torps just popped. He's gonna pop. Make turns for five knots. Maneuvering eye. <clears throat> I mean, I can understand bearing call outs like three adin null, three one zero, but that's about it. <laughs> I used to study Russian, too. And yeah, I don't care for the Russian voiceover. <laughs> okay, uh, you. Making turns for five. Oh, well, 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 well. Let's see what he does with this guy here. Yeah, that oiler looks like it's about to steady out. <clears throat> Con sonar, noisemaker, bearing. Nope, two, it's being a... One. Oh, well. I'm gonna blow through. How do they manage such severe altitude, whatever you want, depth changes? Okay, lost the solution. <clears throat> All right, Mr. Oila, how we doing? Are you worth a 6576 or why not? Kind of running low on U-sets. I don't know about low, we used a fair number. I guess I could probably just... Oh, I am kind of shallow here. I guess I could just ping at that Oberon. It's being annoying with this solution right now. <clears throat> they like to... The torps that airdrop like to go to the starboard. Let's do... This. And let's do... That. Sonar, okay, that P3 bearing. is going to be eight, upset now. Come right to two, zero. Make turns for one, five, oh wait, five, how's this oiler doing? I think he's ready for a torp. Con 
On sonar, we are cavitating. Con, fire control, weapon passing 400 feet. Make depth 168, dive high. Con, sonar, no longer cavitating. Con, sonar, lost contact. Oh, they just Sierra, missed one, him? Oh my, five, dude, two, I... Seven, one, contact faded. Oh, he turned. Okay, might have gotten him if he hadn't. Con, torpedo room, 2-2 two, two ready. Papiek is Tarkova. I don't know, that's Tarkov, something, escape, is that escape from Tarkov? <laughs> Con, torpedo room, tube three ready. Con, sonar, lost contact, Sierra, three, last bearing, two, seven. Con, dive at one, eight, three, dive by. This Oberon is putting up like the fight of fights. I don't even think the LA took this much effort. Con, room, tube four, Twice the frickin' speed. Dude's really pissing me. Oh, what am I doing? Just put up a wire guided torp and frickin' send that Make sucker in. Come on, Torpedo. You know you want to ignore that countermeasure, break to port, and go right up as high and cool it as the. Uh, Oh, the starboard, dude. I swear, it's like rigged. Rigged in the AS favor. This election is rigged. Con, torpedo room, tube four ready. Oh my god, both the starboard. Good god. Let's let these things do their thing first. <clears throat> I, I just, I guess I forget about the tests. I'm biased against the tests. It's just that dangerous waters, the tests suck so bad in dangerous waters. <laughs> so I was like, ew. Sonar, lost contact. Sierra, three. Last bearing, two, seven, six. Contact is in the baffle. I thought I ordered a course. I just hard ruddered over. Okay. <laughs> Steady out, please. Come right to two, one, nine. Helm, I. Make turns for one zero. Make turns for. I'll let these torpedoes do their thing before I shoot this test off. I guess I don't know. This guy's wearing a wire. Some of that text chopped off there. I don't know what that first character is there on the torpedo. There's no, like, eye-looking thing in Russian. Ukrainian has that, but Russian does not. Oh, boom, Karplovsky. There you go. Suck it. On helm. Steady course. Oh, make donuts. <laughs> Stewie, what's up? If you can read this, you're too close. <laughs> it's the oiler maneuvering. That's oh, hard to tell. I think he's steadied out. Hmm. I hate shooting from directly behind. Like, I just want to hit that wake at an angle directly behind. It's just like, eh, er, er. it's like walking on, walking on the edge. Missiles would be nice to just finish that thing off. Just got here and an Oberon blows up. Yeah. 
Do that more often. <laughs> I think that Wakehomer might miss. Unless we get a favorable... Excuse me, a favorable... Is he still, like, slightly turning? I can't tell. I don't think so. Oh, something just blew up. Some torpedo. That was cool. I was like, is that an iceberg? It's a torpedo. Oh, that thing is far. If I'm, if I'm going to shoot it, I'm going to have to shoot at it with another 65, 76er. The question is... Oh, I wish I could more easily draw this out. Let's say, like, here... Is that generous enough on the wake to get a sniff? Get a whiff, get a sniff. I don't know. Should probably just throw another one out there for good measure. Can't just flank at it. There was a P3 flying around. I don't know where that thing went. I don't know if it's bugging out, telling me there isn't anything nearby when there is, or if it's just... Asa lasagna, don't get any on ya. Did these 60s P3s really have, like, these, like, uh... Yellow leading edges? Or is that, like, a missing texture? Yeah, I guess we can just flank towards it. Shoot it down. <laughs> con sonar lost contact. Ah, where was it? Con helm. Is that it? Okay, yeah, it leaves it where it last was. Give me that marker. Hunt them con down. Dive at two, four, four, dive by. Con maneuvering, making turns for three, zero, knots. 16 knots. Ah, nothing. Alright, Mr. Torpedo. It could hit. It could. It's gonna be close as to whether or not it will. If it misses, I think I still will use the 6576 and save the Usits for submarines. Let's take stock of the situation. Come left two, two, zero, four, helm I. <clears throat> Don't need the toad. Con sonar new contact bearing two five six designated Sierra four. Con maneuvering making turns for nine knots. Oh, uh, maybe fishing boat. Con sonar Sierra four is classified as merchant. I was like, oh boy, what did we just frickin' walk into there? Let's just go to periscope depth. Make depth one, two, dive by. I think it's 
too far away to get a bead visually, but maybe we can. <clears throat> How did it retract the toad? Make turns for five knots, maneuvering eye. Oh, there it is. Do boo boo. Nope, sailed right on by. <laughs> Asta lasagna. Okay. Yeah, just keep getting closer. Make sure we don't miss. Track the toad array, ribbit, ribbit. <laughs> oh yeah, my glasses are in the shop, by the way, getting adjusted. That's why I'm not wearing them. I guess I can wear my old computer glasses. Where are they? Oh, they're on the living room. the infinite intercept point on the map as well. Why not? Gotta chase the some get some bitch damn. Make turns for three zero knots. Maneuvering eye. Passing eight hundred feet. Whoa, hey ho, I ordered a depth. Con passing nine hundred feet. I must have pressed a button. At one, eight, three, Nasty habit nine. of doing that sometimes. <clears throat> and get stuck on the bottom as a result and think I'm dead. So I smacked all the time lapse buttons and hit the hide HUD button. I keep forgetting to look into this. Definitely has to do with the uh, game scaling. I think I'll just keep going until we, uh... I have no idea where the hell this thing is. Until we reacquire passively. Oh yeah, no, I can definitely see the plane if I do that. <laughs> it will come and drop all the torpedoes. I mean, I can shoot it down and just, uh, eh. Just avoid it for now. I guess 15 knots closure at 15, at like 15 kilometers distance. Like a half hour to intercept. Con sonar regained contact on Sierra one bearing two, seven, seven. Mark 46 on Sierra. Yeah, it's so risky. It's risky. <laughs> I 
<laughs> I always find manpad to be the funniest acronym. I'm wearing man pads. Uh, are you going to be involved with voiceovers for that new game? Sea power. Yes, I will be. Got some. Julehelm sent me some lines for it a while ago. But uh, just to get a sense of what they would be. Nothing. I haven't gotten the official ones yet. Okay, Mr. Oila. I thought you couldn't build solutions when they were running from you. Maybe that might change that. But yeah, I hate how, like, in uh, Dangerous Waters, you could just, like, expose, like, a foot of the sail and pop out a Sam. It's like, no, there should be, like, some game condition where you have to accept being, like, fully surfaced for X amount of time to launch that thing. But that's yeah, fine. Neither here nor there. Okay, this is good. Boop, 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 boop. Make turns for one, five, not maneuvering eye. There you go. <laughs> the man pad section. <laughs> Makes me think of uh, Robin Big. I don't know if anyone here ever watched. Robin Big. Back in the day, 15 years ago. Sweet Jesus. Con, torpedo room, two, one, ready. To the same place that stores the, uh, the Lost Ark, Top Men, Top Men Warehouse, Indiana Jones. I was about to say how close did I frickin' put this thing. <clears throat> yeah, there you go. It's shallowing out. Let's see here. Kaboom! Sierra, one, last bearing, two, seven, four, contact breaking up. Nice. Okay. Blow this pop stand. <laughs> Karploski. Oh, I never turned it off menu overlay. That's fine. Maybe I should just leave it over there. I don't know. NATO retreats. A sabotage operation. It's easy company running into another company of Germans. Oh, is this going to be more trainist? Trainist. Immediately. Okay. Arhangelsk. Status report, Mr. Squidward. Frickin' Origin. Origin games give me pop-up notifications. Didn't show up on stream, though. <laughs> Listen, all of y'all, it's a sabotage.
What do I want to load out? Going stallions. Why, where's the music? Why did the music go away? It's so quiet. The silence is deafening. Stallions are always fun. Is it true that if you don't use it, you lose it? I've already shot nine things. Good God, that frickin' Oberon. The Bowen. I love this game, but hate playing it. <laughs> Interesting. Are stallions found in the same aisle as the man pads? They're adjacent to the scallions in the vegetable section. Okay, let's do it. Oh, no! <laughs> Dodged a freaking bullet there. Sweet Jesus. He's not trying to sink Remus, he's trying to drive him. Drive him where? Hounds to the hunters. Your submarine captain's gonna make it to America, Ryan. He's gonna die within sight of it. <clears throat> I want my butt. I want some butts! <laughs> Who or what is a private butts? Uh, I'm gonna try and avoid those super shallow waters of the White Sea there. I mean, this is still pretty shallow here, but we'll go with this. Victor 3 Hunter Killer, yes indeed. <laughs> uh. From where am I to expect the sabotage operation? Hey, look at that. Norway is uh, full red. Scandinavia's red. Continental's red. Just Iceland and... Uh, Long year, Bin. The Charlies are predecessors to the Oscar. Yeah, they're guided missile nuclear submarines just meant to take out surface ships, really. Here they come. Horse shit. Went right by me. I need a better indicator of where the hitboxes are on that overmap. <laughs> Weak duct. I wish they would give me the uh, sounding too. Can we change this? Have the sounding as well. <sighs> Weak layer. Okay, so it's going to be somewhat deep. Somewhat. It could just be. 70 more meters after that. 115 Sierra 1. Con, less than 50 feet below the okay, it's not that deep. <laughs> what about what 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 layer at 70 meters is this nonsense? Okay, where was this dude? Like 115? Oh, this sucks. Depth three, zero, dive by. Is this even shallow enough for my stallions to not just ram into the bottom? <clears throat> A white sky, hello. The ground layer. <laughs> the Piedmont. What is Piedmont? Hold on, let me get my spectacles here. And another drink. Be right back. Oh, Mr. Stewie. Oh, you're too kind, Mr. Stewie. <laughs> Gifting all them subs. Have you guys seen my new shirt? <laughs> uh, 
Uh, I don't even know what they do. I, I, I don't like the name. I feel like it should have been like Space Command or something. Okay, let's get back into it. Oh, was that notification showing up late or something? I don't know. That's weird. It just showed up all of a sudden. Maybe it knows when it's not being... I don't know. That's weird. Hmm. Interesting. Come right to zero. Is it too shallow for Toad to get... <laughs> uh, can someone give me a, a Marty emoji? Prepare to Dave! <laughs> Need like a gif of that. That's so damn funny. Conditions are unsafe. Oh, didn't we say it was going to be like 60 or 70 meters? Damn. Yeah, okay. Uh, get yourself back down there then. It's not even that loud. Well, let's start steaming this way. Come right to one, one, nine, helm I. I guess he wants to vote for my doom. Because all you people hate me. <laughs> Isn't F9 time lapse? Oh, I turned off my F keys. How did that happen? I was like, it's not... Not speeding up. Oh no, stay ultra quiet. Don't release, please. Thank you. Con helm, steady course. Careful, could run out of space real fast. 200 feet translates to in metric. Like 60 meters. <clears throat> no. Mm. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. It's fine. Yeah, something like that. Yes, this is going to be lay doozy. I'm fairly certain the uh, the the brief map said it was like one one x compass direction here for the for the contact. I mean, it's fairly quiet. Oh, I forgot to get my glasses too. Yeah, whatever. <clears throat> Cobalt 60. Oh, the drop and run thing. Yeah, I forgot to address that comment. The, the Simpsons opening. <laughs> it's just, yeah, that's just like, oh, generic one, nuclear zero, thing. The glowy zero, thing. One. But yeah, Cobalt 60 is uh, pretty gnarly stuff. Skipjack. Con sonar Sierra 1 is classified as submerged submarine. No, nothing, no, nothing glows green. Okay, well, you can't hear us for crap. Let's get a test loaded up here. I, the game says he's using Toad, which is a pile of crap. I can't use it. shouldn't be able to either. Maybe it's deeper over there. 
But it's not that far. You know, the one thing I liked from the movie Phantom is that their, uh, their renderings of Novembers Calling and Skipjacks were pretty cool looking. They made, they made their own unique vision of it. <clears throat> Skipjacks have towed arrays. Yeah, Bob was curious about that, too. <laughs> Show him with one. Not sure if they were refitted with them. <clears throat> Retrofitted, rather. Well, the way they show them in-game here, they got the little <clears throat> external routing for the toad. But they used to clip them on when they left port. They would just leave it on the whole time. Like some diver would have to go under and clip it on. It wasn't... LA was the first class to have them, like, integri integ integri integri integrally located. Yeah, Sturgeon Permit, and if Skipjack did have it, I'll have this, like, over the exterior piping thing. I would say Victor 3 is probably superior to a Skipjack at this point in time. Skipjack is relatively old speaking in the 80s. <clears throat> Oh, I have no idea about nar Narwhal. Narwhal, Narwhal is such a uh, one-off special boat. Rig ship for ultra quiet. Yep, that's what the big tube is for. Yeah, I think Narwhal is quieter than LA. I think, if my memory serves, the nar Narwhal was a test bed for uh, future uh, <clears throat> high convection reactors. Like stuff, stuff used on the Ohio was like tested on the Narwhal. But it also had like a direct drive propeller shaft, which I think many people weren't a fan of <laughs> retrospectively. Maybe not the, I don't know, rafting. I think it did have an advanced, like, convection. It was, it was an all-natural circulation reactor, wasn't it? Yeah. I think so. It's been so long since I read up about that stuff. And it had the scoops like the Soviet subs do for the uh, feed water. Not feed water, I don't know. Third loop. Third loop, we'll just call it that. Okay. Uh, I want to put... He shouldn't have toad ability right now if I don't. It's a big old pile of horse malarkey. I don't even, I don't know if I should even bother with the frickin' the test. The test here. I should let him open up this distance a bit more. I'm thinking a stallion to put him on his toes and then two usits because the stallion has a better chance of keeping him fixed in one spot and just sending traditional torps out what are these doors those doors are the issue i don't know if they are neither do the british 
Perhaps our friends in Murmansk have thought of something new. Big son of a bitch. I love looking at the cr like the uh, the pressure hole cross section of the skipjack. It's such a mess compared to subsequent American designs. What's so important to get you on a plane in the middle of the night? I don't even know if that's a good James James Earl Jones impersonation there. <laughs> <clears throat> Shoot a tect. I'm afraid I'm just going to lose the wire on the tect. Tech nine? And it's slow. It's a slow torpedo. Skipjack's pretty fast. If it didn't have its toad ability right now, I would. Probably better than what James Earl Jones can muster these days. Oh my god. <laughs> How wooed. Yeah, he's uh yeah, definitely in the nineties. We could not be in, like, a better position. Okay, maybe I shouldn't let him open too much. I know that's going to be tricky for Mark 48 return fire. But it'll just make it harder for us to hit as well. Okay, we're shallow enough for stallions. Let's get that Usit. Usit in there. Maybe I should give him a three Usit spread. Mm. Excuse me. Seeker range 1500. Whale, whale, Mr. Beauregard. Okay. Bleep. Blippity bloppity bloop. Ah, sh let's give those Seekers some overlap, not put them at the exact edge of their cones. Con, torpedo room, tube four ready. <clears throat> Maybe we should bias this this way a little bit since he's kind of already heading that direction. And then make sure they don't enable too close, because that's a, <laughs> a habit of mine. Con, torpedo room, tube six ready. Oh yeah, you can place the guppy, yeehaw. USS Anchovy. <laughs> Yeah, I would probably try the uh, barbell first and then work my way back. All right, let's start the uh, start the action here. Make sure these are actually set to the settings I want. And uh, these like to go to starboard, don't they? So let's do... Oh, minimum range. Okay, let's do like here. It should curl over and get right up on him there. Shoot tube three. Aye, sir. <clears throat> Shoot tube four. Aye, sir. Shoot tube five. Aye, sir. Shoot tube six. Aye, sir. Come. Meet to con sonar. We are cavitating. Con sonar launch transient from Sierra to Con sonar Sierra two is cavitating. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Con sonar noisemaker bearing one two three. Go starboard, 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 starboard. Con, Give me that dice roll. Two, three ready. Starboard. Con, helm, Damn course. it. <laughs> I put the car end up there. It's going to take forever to get that thing loaded up. <clears throat> We're 
We're near Gremiha. This is like that one mission in uh the sub command? No, Red Storm Five. Rising. Torpedo room, tube four ready. Oh, Mark 48 inbound, yikes. Con sonar, noisemaker, bearing. One, three, two. Sierra two. Oh, sweet Jesus, there's another sub out here. Con, torpedo room, tube five ready. Con sonar. Which Con way is he turning, Jones? To the three, starboard, three, sir! Three, <laughs> Interesting hand motion. Yeah, it's the dice roll. Con, torpedo room, tube six ready. It's your brain out of the gutter. <laughs> Con sonar, noisemaker, bearing. One, four, three. It's a slippery fish, that Skippy Jack. Go to starboard, you. F <laughs> Why do they always give me these missions at the end of a frickin' patrol? Is that on purpose? <clears throat> Go to frickin' Stabbit. Sierra 2 is classified as submerged submarine. He's a sturgeon. Con sonar. Sierra 2 is classified as submerged submarine. These stallions put a frickin' uh, kink in my style. Ache in my style. What's the word I'm thinking of? Cramp in my style. Sometimes they're like, no, we're going to go 270 one, degrees five, before zero. we lock on to something. And then they're like, eh, we'll do it right away. Come right to zero, three, zero. Helm, I. Con Where are these? Where are these Mark 48s at? Con sonar, no longer cavitating. Con, helm, steady course. Make turns for five knots. I can't even hear it. Why can't I hear this Mark 48 inbound? It might be behind me. Keep going. Make turns for three. Z Con sonar, we are cavitating. Con sonar, noisemaker bearing one, five, six. Maybe we'll give that sturgeon a, a stallion here. The water's like 200, 200 feet. Oh yeah, Sturgeon's just chilling there. Definitely needs a stallion. Con, torpedo room, tube three ready. All right, well, we have some newfound knowledge from this last Make go at four, it. One, five, Where's five, the, uh, where are my other torps at? Where are these other things? That's the stallion. Con sonar, noisemaker, bearing one, five, nine. Where are all my usits? Maneuvering, making turns for one, five, not. They'll run to the doit. The hell's going on? All my usits are gone. I don't know why. <clears throat> all right, newfound knowledge. They go to starboard. Let's plunk it in close. Aye, sir. Con sonar lost contact. Oh, I was like, what the hell did I just shoot? It sound it sounded different. I thought I shot a normal torpedo. Con sonar regained contact. Why the hell they hit the bottom? Stallion hasn't. One, four, seven. What is that? 
Oh, is that my little uh, ship indicator icon? <laughs> Ooh, the camera rotation point is back where the missile was. Rockets, whatever. All right, we gotta plunk this asshole. Yes, uh, yes, yes. No. Ah. I love and hate these noisemakers. It's like, oh, it's masked by the frickin' sub. <clears throat> Did it really get that much more shallow? I, it's not like I was scraping the bottom. I call horse shit. Make turns for five con sonar. No longer cavitating. Uh, no, I just got to watch this countermeasure dance. Please break the po Yes, yes, yes. What is that, the New York Islanders? Oh, you, you, you tricked me. Come on, come on. Yes, 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 yes. Maneuvering, making turns for five knots. He's not dead. There's a torpedo. Come left to Con sonar, we are cavitating. And that's it for stallions. Con sonar lost contact. Sierra two. Last bearing one five two. Contact is in the baffles. Con sonar regained contact on Sierra one bearing one six seven. Con sonar regained contact on Sierra con helm steady course. Yeah, you would think a damage target would be like, no, nope, maybe we shouldn't two, do this. I do not have any anti shipping missiles. Unfortunately, this thing is uh, anti submarine warfare only. <clears throat> that Mark 48 is trouble if it's passive. If it's active, I think we have it dodged. really hate having like freaking four different types of torpedoes to bring along. <laughs> Such a cramp in the old style there. Maintain depth. <laughs> Is it going to be like a nuclear explosion when it hits the bottom? <laughs> Con sonar lost contact. Sierra two last bearing one four five contact faded. Okay, I think it may be stuck on the bottom. Let's uh let's try this. Maybe stuck on the bottom. Yeah, 
Yeah, that torpedo tube launch SSM didn't really come around till the club. Club? Cloop? Con, torpedo room, tube three ready. Yeah, I don't, I don't think the cloop was until the 90s. <clears throat> I don't know if development started during the Soviet days or what. They're lying on the bottom of the Torpor Choir. I don't know. I hope so. <laughs> and the Skipjack launched the Mark 40s too that also did not reach me. Yeah, yes. Ring shift for ultra quiet. Come left to one zero three helm I. Make turns for three knots, maneuvering I. Up angle, no up angle, I'll press W. <clears throat> Con maneuvering, making turns for three knots. Oh, there's a torpedo. When was that launched? Looks like he launched it at my previous course and speed there. Frickin' passive Mark 48s. Let me be right back. I'm going to grab the glasses. Palo Verde. Well, well. Is that in, like, uh, Arizona or something? I've heard the name. Con sonar regained contact on Sierra 2, bearing 1, 4, I do not know three. all the plant names. Uh, I mean, I don't... I just don't know them all well as much as I would if I were, like, uh, more involved with the reactors. But, yeah, congratulations. Awesome. Oh, it looks like he uh, has gotten moving. Was he just going to sit there on the bottom and be like, uh, Aaron, just going to see what happens. Oh. Did I order a course change? I think I did. 103. Okay, we're about to study out here. Okay, Sturgeon got wise and started... I guess he was just going to sit on the bottom and be like, doop -a doop That torpedo will miss then. The old Diablo Canyon. Con sonar regained contact on Sierra 1, bearing 1, 5, 8. What is this thing doing? Con helm, steady course. <laughs> what is happening? It's like And I hit the mic, I'm sorry. It's like we're playing sub command, it's going up and down in clunky movements. Oh, this, mm, this sturgeon. OK, 
Okay, they can't hear me at all, really. Let's go to seven knots here. Make turns, <clears throat> make turns for seven. Oh, now the skipjack doesn't have its toe deployed. Con sonar lost contact. Sierra one, last bearing one six zero. Contact faded. <laughs> ZS5. Scram. Beat it. What is going on? This is the weirdest thing I've ever seen. Hardware is ancient indeed. Yeah, most of them came online in the 60s or 70s. Maybe 80s. And if it ain't broke, they ain't gonna fix it. Oh, it's going back on the bottom again. What the hell? <clears throat> oh, there it goes. Okay, we need to get closer is what we need to do. Con sonar lost contact. <laughs> Sierra, two, last bearing. It's one, not enough to destroy three, it. Two, contact faded. Oh, that frickin' he launched a nerf herder launched a damn torp at me. Come left to two nine nine helm I make turns for con sonar. We are cavitating. Con sonar regained contact on Sierra two bearing one three two. <laughs> Scruffy looking nerf herder. Oh, now he's accelerating again. What is this guy doing with his life? Con sonar lost contact. Sierra two last bearing one three three contact is in the baffles. Con helm steady course. <clears throat> I think Hilty Brain is asking if they still use magnetic tape. I know some of the control rooms are still like what you would see in a, the China Syndrome. Okay, the plan is he seems to be getting stuck. I want to kind of like loop around and sneak up on him if possible. It might not be possible. If he's all stop. <laughs> Not sure we can sneak up on them, but we'll try. God damn it! Con maneuvering, making turns for three zero knots. Con sonar launch transient from Sierra One. <sighs> pesky, pesky. That probably was a good... I should have used the wire guy to torp just then. Damn. Ugh. Okay. I have no idea about tape storage. <laughs> we don't even use, like, my company really didn't even use paper anymore. But we don't operate reactors. Old Skippy chilling at five knots, eh? 
old Skippy. Just listening and shooting. Uh, got ourselves a crappy situation here. Yeah, it looks like that torp is right here in the old baffles. So we're definitely safe from that torp. Make turn con sonar, no longer cavitating. Come right to zero six eight helm I. Well, uh, let's all quiet. See if that skipjack Con can't sonar, drop our track. Con sonar regained contact on. I know zero, you can two, you can talk. One, three, I just zero. have no idea about magnetic tape. <laughs> oh, stop! Sonar, I keep pressing W. Contact, keep ascending. Zero, two, Stop ascending. Why do I keep hitting W or S? I'm hitting something. Hitting buttons. Con maneuvering. Making turns for five nine. <clears throat> we need to launch a wire guided torp. Against old Skippy there. I wanna get closer. I'm gonna bring him in closer. I'm gonna do what? Did. Oh my god, again? The hell? Tape is indeed reliable. Do they store that in salt mines like old film prints? Far away is that last position, 14,000 meters. I know Skipjack launched another torp at us, but I can't even hear it. Make turns for five knots. Okay, let's get cooking a little bit Con here. Sonar. We are cavitating. Get away from that Con thing's position. <laughs> Maybe a little faster. Make turns for three <clears throat> zero knots. Maneuvering eye. Why am I hearing the sturgeon? Is it pinging? No longer cavitating. Oh my god, oh my god. The con sonar, we are cavitating. Oh, there's con a wire. Hold on. Con, Stop. Helm, steady course. Make turns for two zero knots. Maneuvering eye. Oh, did I accidentally drop a countermeasure and like con, spoof that Mark 48? Two zero knots. Get away from that countermeasure. Oh my god, dude, this is insanity. They're just keeping me at bay. I'm just gonna hold them out till they launch, expend all their stores. Con sonar regained contact on Sierra one. <laughs> Mark 48 one, derped seven, out. Come right to okay. Zero, six, nine, helm I. Panic, distress, worry. Con sonar lost contact. Sierra, what was this mark one, for? Last bearing one. Oh. Six, six. Like one of those previous torpedoes flopping around. I think we were picking up the sturgeon just because he was pinging. One, I think it's still bearing, stuck on the bottom. Six, six. Did that torpedo disappear? I think it descended to the dirt. Okay. Chill, 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 chill. Make turns for one. Let's. Rig ship for ultra quiet. Are there any more frickin' torpedoes? In the gosh dang water there, Napoleon. Con sonar regained contact on Sierra two bearing one four three. Yep, look at that. Passes right through the mark. Sturgeon's still sitting on the bottom, just pinging. Okay, we're gonna drive that direction. Con sonar lost contact. Sierra one last bearing one six eight contact faded. Gonna try and get away from that. Skipjack a little bit first, though. Helm right to one zero three. Helm I. Oh my God, dude! I keep what the heck? What button do I keep pressing? And why? I don't remember doing it. <laughs> oh boy. Make make turns. Make turns for con sonar. We 
Whoa, chill. The hell. Con sonar, no longer cavitating. I'm gonna shoot a test. He was stuck on the bottom before and I shot a use it and then he got wise and decided to evade. So we're gonna do a test, but I wanna get closer. Yeah, test will be what is needed here. I guess some of my hesitancy from using it before is that got to worry about return fire. The wire's just going to snap anyway. But here... I guess with that skipjack, should have let the distance open up a bit more. Less likely to hear the launch. It's just hard to try and, like, displace... Get away from datum, because the wire's going to snap. <clears throat> Those Mark 48s are fast and good. <laughs> fast and good. They have no RPG type downside. And not rocket propel grenade role playing game. If that needs to be made clear. Wait for it. Oh, it also says what the scale is up in the top right. Has it always done that? Interesting. Duncan, hello. Yeah, the, the speed is one part of the wire snappage, and then you got to worry about orientation and angles and stuff too where am I at I'm at 120 DB skip check at 135 oh really okay wow sturgeon at 118 when do the sturgeons first get commissioned and when did Victor 3 get commissioned? I wouldn't think it would be that comparable. But Victor 3 was the first one to start the walker silence thing. First Sturgeon, late 60s. First Victor 3, late 70s. First Akula, 84. I know that. Well, Vicky, Vicky 1 is one thing. Vicky 3 is almost a completely different boat from the previous Victors. <clears throat> Victor 379, okay. Ten-year lag, 2 dB louder. Walker spy ring. I can't see what a cool is in here. Only American boats. Or what the game says for dB. And I, one number does not capture the entirety of it. I do realize that. <laughs> All right, this may be good enough. I wish they would start pinging again so we could see if they really are still there, but we'll uh we'll go for it. <clears throat> Come right to 164 Helm I. Doogie, what's up, man? Been a minute. How's it crack a lacking? It's kicking chicken. All that kind of. <laughs> 
sing-songy stuff. Two Victor 3s are still active, huh? I know it was like four when Dangerous Waters came out. 17 years ago? Sweet Jesus. Life's kicking your ass. Ah, oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Hang in there. Hang tough, as Captain Major Winters would say. It will get better. Con, helm, <clears throat> steady course. Okay, let's uh, start the music. Shoot two, three. Aye, sir. Question is, is this going to wake up everyone and their grandmother to my presence here? I should end up in here and all their, their transients from, from pretty far away. <clears throat> what? I didn't realize it showed your... Ah, uh, maybe I knew that at some point. Have these bars always been here? Ah. Uh, <laughs> this one's blank. What's over in that... Okay. <laughs> Just getting very observant all of a sudden. Oh, just full bore, like, blue reflection in the glasses there. <laughs> I got this big, like, diffuser shim. Gives me a nice big blue orb in the eyes. Man, this whole area is at freaking 58 meters. <sighs> yeah, that must be Grammy Ha right there. And then that Red Storm Rising mission, you followed that Delta all the way down to here. And then back here is like, you get like the orders to back off because like, what is the, what does the message say? Like wars imminent? Okay, that's a little more displaced from there. Might be starting to move. <clears throat> okay, can get an active return. Oh, not anymore. Must be turning away. Uh, let's actually slow down. I don't want to close this distance any closer with him than I have to. <clears throat> Do you get cold waters? How much is it? Is it even on Steam now? It's like twenty bucks now. Excuse me, it's worth it, man. Excuse me. And for these busy adult lives, you can just get in, play a quick match, get out. Don't have to commit half a day. Like some dangerous waters missions. <laughs> But I guess Dangerous Waters has the advantage you can you can save a match in game. <clears throat> People will say Arcady. It's more captain oriented than Dangerous Waters. It's still on the sim side of things. Oh my god, he's running away. Uh, it's like he knows that it's a wire torpedo, okay. <sighs> he might outrun this thing. You know, sometimes I hate the AI. <laughs> Why you gotta be so intelligent, man? Damn it. And just doing his weird sawtooth thing. Ah. Patience runs thin here. This torp's not gonna catch him. He's gonna outrun it. God damn it. I didn't get close enough.
Unlike Dangerous Waters, where it gives you the option to mess with things, this one doesn't really. But yeah, it's more Captain Simulator. It lets you focus on the tactics more. In Dangerous Waters, you can do the AI, but sometimes you're like, eh, it'd be better if I could just do it myself and then get stuck micromanaging as the situation deteriorates. But TMA solutions are also just kind of whatever in this game. <laughs> Any logic you learned in Dangerous Waters as to how solution generations, solution generation works is just out the window in this game. Like lead lag, high bearing rate, low bearing rate doesn't really make too much of a difference in this game. Oh. What happens if I do this? Is he going to be like, oh, the torpedo's not following me? I mean, they might as well try. It's not going to catch up. Catch up, catch up, catch up, catch up. Okay, yeah, we were talking about toad shrouds earlier. Here's the sturgeon one. Looks a little more proper, but there's the shroud going over to the, uh, whatever you want to call that, stabilizer or something. Not, not sure why the sturgeon has these, but the LA doesn't. And why so many games assume that the LA did have them. LA has never had these things. 688i has these things down here. I think those are supposed to be like anti-torque roll things. Ohio has these. Sturgeon has these. LA never had these. Okay, he doesn't seem to care that the, the torpedo is just going a different direction. When's he going to start caring? Where's that omnipotent AI? <clears throat> Keep rewatching the DW vids. Oh, really? Nice. Which campaign? Which campaign in particular? If there is one. I'm uh, saving my dangerous waters energy for modern naval warfare. And also, I don't really know of much else to really play in dangerous waters at this point. <laughs> Played most of it. I know there's like some single missions out there still lurking around. A USA service boat and hunt Victor 3 is good luck. <laughs> I hunted a Alpha in the Ticonderoga once. Being able to spam ass rocks was amazingly lethargic. Interesting. Okay, so the AI. Well, we should just do this. How do you. Is there a way to shut down or can I only like snap the wire? I would like to shut it down so the sturgeon stops running. The Lamu RSR, okay. Yeah, RA and the one with Lamu. Yeah, the Lamu one was bugged. I tried to fix the P3 Norwegian mission in Lamu. And Lamu must have changed something. Like, the scripting just wouldn't work no matter what I tried. But it would work fine in stock. Very annoying. Enable and hit the bottom. Oh, well, yeah, why didn't I think of that? Yep, but I don't know what the bottom went about. That's so weird. It kept going, even though the torp wasn't. Heading for him. Okay, you can see how the logic is working a little bit behind the scenes there. Player torpedo in water equals evade. Con sonar lost contact. Shit. Sierra two last bearing one nine six contact faded. 
All right, let's head that way again. Uh, we're gonna get closer. Maybe 5,000 yards. Con, helm, steady course. Objective here is to kill Sturgeon, yeah, because it's carrying seals. There's also a skipjack, but the skipjack cannot carry seals according to the game logic here. Okay, we're gonna have to get quieter as we get to that point. I'm assuming Mr. Sturgeon is back to resting on the bottom at this point. <laughs> How far are we? I'll wait till 10,000 yards and then, uh... Can the engines to one-third there. Isn't the skipjack very loud? Yeah. Must be heading south or something, or just lurking pretty far away. Yeah, they gotta get to Arhangelsk. We're at the entrance to the White Sea right now. There's Gremiha, like from that one Red Storm Rising mission. There's the entrance to the White Sea. Arhangelsk is somewhere down here. But it doesn't... That's their objective on, like, the over map, but on the tactical map, it's kind of just like a free-for-all. They don't necessarily just, like, head that way. Ooh, slow down. Make turns for... Rig ship for ultra-quiet. Come right to... One, nine, seven, helm, I. Look like Walter White. <laughs> I am the one who knocks. Say my name. You're Heisenberg. Goddamn right. I haven't watched that show since it... Uh, since the, the finale originally aired. I kind of feel no need to revisit it. Whoa! What? Skipjack's up there. Interesting. It seems like he headed for my last position. It's weird. <clears throat> Okay, hold on. Uh, I know this can be worked out. The math for how close we have to be for the sturgeon to not be able to run away from our test. The question is how we got variable ranges. I don't know what that range is. <laughs> I think at one point I had a calculator or I even made this calculation at some point on a video. 35 knots, 25 kilometers. 5,000 seems like it should be good enough. 5,000 meters. I'm the one who pings. <laughs> Zero yards, the safest option. Breaking Bad's good. It is good. But yeah, I don't really have the urge to watch it again. Just because I know I'm getting like involved in some whole five season ordeal. This constant 58 meter depth. I don't, I don't believe you. Was that a ping? Oh, I saw a little ray. Oh, 626, yeehaw. All right, let's get a crack in here. What would the math on this be? Con sonar, 
regained contact on Sierra Whoa. two bearing one nine six. Make turns for four knots. Maneuvering eyes. And I knew this math at some point. Con maneuvering. Making turns for four knots. What would the setup be? It's like torpedo speed equals ship speed plus max range or something like that. What's the rush? I was just getting close to dinner time. <laughs> okay, so this sturgeon, for a little background, is a... Uh, okay, no, he's actually afloat now. I had hit him with a stallion earlier, so he was actually resting on the bottom at some point <laughs> until a torpedo came his way. It seems like he's actually driving around right now. Let's wait for the solution to firm up. Okay, there he is right there. Yeah, see, there you go. He's on the bottom. And we're about to lose track. Nope, he just bounced up. Okay, keep going five knots. Make turns for five knots. Maneuvering eye. <laughs> Being so derpy. Oh, he loses all... Does he lose all ability to detect passive when he's on the bottom? Oh. <laughs> uh. Come right to two, five, seven, helm, I... Says he can get a ping on me. Let's try and get in them baffles. Yeah, there you go. All right, let's, uh... Steady course. Oh, we just came off the bottom. I was about to say, let's launch this torpedo. Come left to two, one, two, helm, I. Four, uh... <laughs> uh. Stop getting me out of your baffles. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just thinking of something funny in my brain. And I don't think anyone's going to understand the reference. <laughs> Unless you watch Red Letter Media. Let's keep going. Right to two, six, three, helm, I. Con, helm. Steady course. I don't know what makes him want to get off the bottom. Maybe he just doesn't do it in time lapse. Interesting. He seems to, to come off when the time lapse starts. So let's keep the time lapse on. <laughs> yeah, that's why I'm trying to get into his baffles. Yeah, so now he can't get. Can't get no return on me, Lieutenant Dan. Come left to two, one, four, helm I. Alright, let's do this thing with the chicken wang. Shoot two, three. Con, helm, steady course. Once it gets to the activation point, I'm going to turn off time lapse and we'll guide it in. Because I know once I turn off time lapse, it's going to start ascending. Con, fire control, weapon acquired. <laughs> Con, sonar regained contact on Sierra 1, bearing 3, 3, 6. Oh, is his rear end about to go? Oh. <laughs> Why is it doing that? It's so weird. Alright, launch your countermeasure. 
Dude, if he doesn't la launch a countermeasure, I'm gonna be like, WTF. Maybe he's out. Can he? Uh, so nope, there you go. No, no, no. Seven, seven. We don't do countermeasures here. No, no, no. Con, fire control, weapon acquired. Oh god, don't be cheeky. Oh! Con, sonar, yeah! Contact. Sierra, two, last bearing, one, seven, five. Contact breaking up. How close is that skipjack? <clears throat> Pearly pink panty. <laughs> what? Skipjack's kind of close. That's fine. Finally, I've beaten one of these SEAL missions. Ah, uh, what are you doing, Skippy? What are you doing, Skippy? Okay, we're, we're, we're faster than him. Or not as noisy as him. So let's frickin' go a little faster here. We're about to lose him on the passive. Hey, look at that, it's opening, all right. It said 6.8, then jumped to 7. Okay, now it's going up again. It's like it's taking a sweet time. <clears throat> Con, sonar, lost contact. Sierra, 1. Last bearing, 0. 0. Alright, we're just going to head this direction until, uh... I'm out of testes? I am out of testes. <laughs> Oh, I don't even want to dump the corns if they don't know I'm here. Don't even want to acknowledge my presence at that point. Just gonna steam away this way. Come right to two, five, one, helm I. Their janky ass AI ability to let out the toad when I can't. Nonsense, Sally. Excuse me. Well, that was interesting. <laughs> Damaged the sturgeon. Should have been stuck on the bottom in perpetuity. Could have been over a lot sooner. Did I say in perpetuity? Would it be in perpetuity? The perpetual motion device? I think if I turn to try and hear that skipjack, I wouldn't even hear him anymore. It's just that far away. But still uh, close enough to keep us from leaving the mission. Excuse me. Um, what's going on? Where are you at, guy? Are you are you tailing me? Is that why this is taking a while. Come right. Let's see what's up. Three, if we come this three, way. Four. Helm I. Con helm. Steady course. Come right to. Three, three, five. Helm I. I think we just gotta work it out. It's gonna take a little time here. Con, Is there helm, ultra mega three, time four. lapse? I could make a thumbnail. Mm -hmm. 
Any second now, any second. What is it like? Is it like 15,000 meters? Did I get the all clear? Something like that. There you go. Bye. Oh, you missed it. No. It was uh, straightforward, but you still missed it. <laughs> that wasn't meant to be snarky. <laughs> Good job. Oh, I haven't seen that freaking picture in a while. That's from like the stock game. A NATO submarine was sunk. A representative of the USSR has said today that a NATO submarine allegedly carrying a sabotage group was sunk near Arhangelsk. Confirm or deny. Rearm and repair. <laughs> what is this voice? Okay, sweet. All right, we will stop it there. Thank you guys for watching. See you guys next time. Have a good one. As always, good hunting. Suck it, sabotage group.